Like Rebecca Black once said, it's Friday, Friday, Friday. I'm Mr. Olson. This is my small hobbit emo friend. I'm not small. My name is Maddie. And this is the Cosmo Daily for Friday, October 13th. Your announcements are up next. Patriot Pat auditions are coming today and Monday the 16th. If you're interested in playing our very own school mascot, a few things you need. You gotta be in room 20 during one of any of the three lunches. You need to have school spirit. You have to have a skit ready to perform and you need to be available after school when we do things that require Patriot Pat. Again, auditions are today and next Monday during all school lunches in room 20. Come here, Keontae. I heard you're gonna try out for Patriot Pat. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna do a double backflip. Dude, you can't do that on TV. So here, take that with you. <laughs> Inappropriate. Admissions representatives from colleges and universities continue to visit Cosmo this month for College Tober. Monday during first hour, Ferris College will be paying a visit. Then sixth hour is Kettering University. If you're interested, sign up in counseling today. In school sports for today, Friday, October 13th at 7 p.m., the varsity football team is at Lance Cruz. And then at 7 p.m., Varsity Cheer is also there. They're there at the same time, not then, it's at the same time. On Saturday, October 14th at 9 a.m., Varsity Volleyball is at the Fitzgerald Tourney. And Boys, Girls, and Cross Country is at the Macomb County Championship at Stony Creek Metro Park at 10 a.m. There's no bus, so you're gonna have to drive there or because you're in cross country, you should probably just run yourself there. For sports information, updates, cancellations, make sure to check out our website at CousinoAthletics.com. Student government had a meeting this week. Here are some of the highlights. Hi, I'm Lily Pollock, and I'm here interviewing Selena Dixon, president of the Cousineau Student Government, and I just have a few questions for her. Can you please give us a short summary on what the student government is? Yes, so basically I am student government president. I run these monthly meetings um, for the student council, or student government reps. Um, I also talk at pep rallies and um, if I were a senior, I'd be talking at graduation, but I'm only a sophomore, so that's not my job yet. But um, I also talk at Academy Awards and things that basically just involve the whole student body. Have there been any challenges that you have faced in student government? And if so, what are they and how have you overcome them? Um, yeah, I've had a bunch of challenges so far since I'm relatively new to the class and taking on this big role. I have had some challenges with just my grade being younger than everyone else and having to take charge has been just a little bit of a challenge, but I've been overcoming it, trying to be more, um, just being more vocal and saying my opinions and all that type of stuff. I, I've been able to overcome that goal. Um, yeah. And are there any big events that we can look forward to um, as this quarter comes to a close? Yeah, so right now student government is planning Powder Buff, which will be on November 9th. It's basically boys will be pay playing um, volleyball. It's going to be held like a volleyball tournament. Um, boys of all grades will be participating. Um, and to participate, it will be $10. And to watch, it'll be $5. So basically, they'll be making teams, uh, two teams per grade. And yeah, so it'll be on November 9th. It's open to the whole student body. That'll be our community event. Looking for academic help? You can get tutoring in the Media Center every week, Monday through Thursday from 2.30 until 3.30. Uh, that's about it for your Friday updates. Thanks for joining us, Cosmo. We're going to take you into your weekend with some amazing music. This is one of the best songs and videos ever made. It's called Taste the Biscuit. Go ahead. Taste it for the weekend, guys. We'll see you. Taste the biscuit. Taste the goodness of the biscuit.